Happy Friday, everyone. I hope you had an amazing week. I did. This week on Beauty Booth, it has been all about hair. Human hair, 100%. And we've been working with the lady Bertha Garo from Miss Beloft, and she has helped us understand what it is when it comes to you know, taking care of your wigs, layer, layering your, your frontals, combing them. And right now, we're about to wind up, but there's a lot to discuss. So. Batha, thank you so much for being in studio and being with us throughout the week and tell us what it is that we need to do, you know, when it comes to looking good with wigs. Thank you so much, Chris. Yeah. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for having me mm -hmm. here. Now, uh, quickly, I just want to run through and uh, tell you about something called a quick fix. Quick fix. A lot of people do not understand what you mean by a, a quick, quick fix. fix. Yeah, For yeah. instance, a quick fix is like mm -hmm. uh, having a wig. You mm -hmm. just wear it and you're out of the door. It's how quickly are you able to slay and look fly and get out of the door. Yeah, yeah. Right? So there's one which is called a wig. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to jump through and show you about the ponytail. Yes. Now, this is how the ponytail looks. It has a tail and it has this mm -hmm. and it also has a clip in here. Mm -hmm. So what happens is that the ladies, when you hold your hair, either at the middle or at the front uh -huh. or completely at the, the back, back uh -huh. that is the low ponytail. Mm -hmm. Once you're done with that, you just take this, you create a kind of ponytail. Yes. This is what will help you, the tail, I call it a tail. The tail. Uh -huh. Then now you just push it round, you mm -hmm. put it round completely. Mm -hmm. And the good, I can see the hair is meant to cover now the, the Yes, the, the hair string. is meant to cover the string. Like the string, yeah, exactly. the tail that you're calling. Exactly, mm -hmm. and then you have the ponytail. So Kelly, all these women that you're seeing in the streets and they have all these luxurious yes. hair, and it's actually this. And uh, this is the, <laughs> the kinky straight. Oh my God, you have I remember, I'm a good student, <laughs> thank you. So, yes. and I, guys, what do you think? It looks so natural, look at that. It this? looks like a lady's hair. So when you, or in your inner matter too, this is a PSV, and someone is right ahead of you, in yeah. the seat ahead of you, and you see them, these. And you might think it's their hair, but my friend. It's called Good Quality Hair from Miss B. Love. <laughs> 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 All right. Okay. The second one that I'd mm -hmm. like to introduce you guys to is mm -hmm. something called clip-ins. Clip-ins are very, very common, especially with the Asian community. Uh -huh. And I've seen a lot of ladies also embracing it. Mm -hmm. Now, remember the kind of textures, the different textures that we were talking about yes, yes, on yes. Monday, I think? Uh -huh. Yes. Now, the same, same thing. You might get this in straight, body wave, kinky, mm -hmm. straight, kinky straight, kinky curly, all that. Now, the reason why I'm doing this is for you to see how the clips look like. You see, this is what, what we're talking about when you talk about clip lens, uh -huh. right? Clip and lens. they all come in different dimensions. You uh -huh. see, this is a bit shorter uh -huh. in comparison, for instance, to something like this. That. Exactly. Okay. And of course, we have the very, very long one, right? Now, yes. when you come to Miss B Loft, we can be able to show you how exactly to place this. Mm -hmm. Kelly, do you know how to place this? No, you I don't. don't. <laughs> so, no, no, how do this come in handy? Now, this come in handy in regards to this. Huh? Either you're traveling, you're in the hotel room, there's no salon nearby, or you're in the house and you just need a quick fix, right? Uh -huh. This is what you do. You mm -hmm. see the clips? You oh. just remove them like this. Like uh -huh. you push it towards, uh, outwards, uh -huh. sorry. Then when you want to clip in mm -hmm. again, you push it inwards. What happens is, when you've already demarcated your hair, this is what anchors onto your hair. Mm -hmm. Now, how you trap this hair, it's like a weaving aspect, but this is clips. Now, you trap the hair, then you close the clip. And then you you get when you pull it, it's quite tight? No, it's quite tight because this is the clip. It's actually capturing the hair and closing it in. Right? Whoa. Now, that's the reason they're called clippings and they're very, very efficient. Now, what usually happens is that now the long one, you'd be able, of course, to put it from ear to ear. Mm -hmm. The short ones a bit, you'd be able to put it at the back. At the back so yeah. they have different lengths for such a purpose and they're very, very, very easy to work around. Let with. me ask. <laughs> I think I've seen this happen. I've seen yes. in the movies whereby a lady is, okay, okay, in the movies, she just does like this and then something comes off oh. and it's something like this. <laughs> 
just something sim small like this so she doesn't like oh my clip-ons my extensions yes, are these exactly. the ones they call these extensions are the ones. yes these are the ones these are the ones mm -hmm. remember kelly at the end of the day remember when you were talking about the hair bundles so the hair bundles you're able to be sewn in so what they use is a needle and the thread yes but now in this case it's already clips mm -hmm. so you just make sure you have your cornrows you clip in the hair and that's it but also at the same time you can leave part of your hair and clip, clip. this leave again part of your hair then clip this what you normally call track and sew and it's very very easy and very amazing amazing i know right Yo, <laughs> for sure these are quick fixes yes so right. then mm -hmm. uh, last but not least of course mm -hmm. it's something i call the bangs or the fringe mm -hmm. now kelly since you've been so sweet guys be <laughs> before we Monday. started this episode <laughs> We've been fanning over here and uh, one of the things that really surprised me was this. Yes. Because the first thing I asked her, please don't tell me it's what I'm thinking. Yes, it is, Kelly. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I can use it as my model, right? Please do. Okay, mm -hmm. beautiful. Now, mm -hmm. face on the side, let me All show right. them. Now, this is how you're supposed to fix it, mm -hmm. right? Depending on where you want the fringe to be, you can either move it all the way till there. Okay. And you can be able to flip it around. Kelly, I know you've seen the ladies doing this. So yes, you can well always... <laughs> We do, th w these are the things we touch when you want to see your face properly. <laughs> so this is how mm -hmm. the fringe looks like. And mm -hmm. you're able again to style it. You're able to color it because again, it's 100% mm -hmm. human hair. So that's the last but not least. Okay, so you can use this and also use the ponytail. Thank Just you. Just to make sure the, the bangs in. is now because the ponytail is um, the kinky it's straight, kinky to make straight. sure your bangs are kinky straight. Kinky straight. I see you learning how about very, that? very well. Yes. Good, yeah. <laughs> All right. So this is that. Mm -hmm. And of course, now, as we've talked about the wigs, mm -hmm. you can get different, different wigs in, yeah, the, yeah. in, in the store, right? Mm -hmm. Of course, this is a kinky curly. This curly, we call yes. it like Afro kinky curly. Mm -hmm. Of course, we have the braided wigs, which yeah. are very, very nice. And you can see it has also the ponytail. The baby, yeah, yeah the, the, the baby, baby hair. Sorry. Mm -hmm. And of course, you can also get a wig like what I'm wearing. Yeah, yeah. But remember, Kelly, we are investing so much money in mm -hmm. these wigs. Mm -hmm. So how you take care of your wig is very, very important. Mm -hmm. When you go to the house and you remove it, don't just throw, throw it, it away or anything of the sort. There's something very practical that we actually have in, mm -hmm. in the store. You What's know what this is? No. You don't know? You know, they already look like toys, the one that we let our kids uh, play around. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah. This is called a wig holder, ladies. And it's very, very easy for you guys to actually handle this. Mm -hmm. Now, it's called a clipping system, right? You see where, how I'm going about it, huh? It's mm -hmm. clip and fit. Then mm -hmm. again, at the top, clip and fit. And, fit. and you kind of have a semi-head. Okay. Then this is the last piece. To put it that together. Actually, exactly. You just clip mm -hmm. there. Thank you, Kelly. Then you clip on that side, you clip on this side, you mm -hmm. clip on this side, and you already have a head. When you get to the house, remove your wig and place it over there, and it's as easy as that. Oh, if we would take one of these wigs and place it over here. Yes. Right? Yes, we can take this oh, one. Yeah, please it's much show us. easier. Mm -hmm. So when you have this, mm -hmm. you get to the house. And just and you just place it like that As you and it's very very practical because at the end of the day it's portable and you're able to travel with it you see this one when in terms of traveling it's very bulky mm -hmm, mm -hmm, so you need yeah, something true. very easy when you're traveling and all that stuff and it's not occupying so much space especially ladies mm -hmm. when you're going for two days it's like we're going for two weeks so you need <laughs> all of the room that you need so this is very very practical for you ladies yes and actually the amazing bit about it I, I know before ladies used to either be told if you can buy a mannequin buy it the small ones you yes. know but Packing, imagine packing like four money queens and you're going for a <laughs> holiday for two weeks. That's, it's too, much. that's too much. But it's this on the much. moment you dis, uh, disassemble it, yes. uh, easier to pack, doesn't occupy a lot of space. You can carry even four for your four weeks Beautiful. and uh, you rock throughout your entire holiday. Yes. How amazing. Yes. Uh, now, before we wind up, what are the do's and don'ts finally as we wrap mm -hmm. it up of taking care of your wig? Let us look at, you know, when it comes to the heat, let us look at when it comes to the combing and what is the, the wash. Okay, fine. Yes. Now, ladies, always know the kind of texture that you bought or mm -hmm. you have. Mm -hmm. And that's why it was very important for me to start on Monday in mm -hmm. regards to uh, explaining to you guys, giving you the knowledge of what kind of texture it is. Yeah, yeah. A straight hair, how you treat a straight hair is totally different how you treat a curly hair or a kinky curly. Why? True. Because they are curl curtain and a straight hair is a straight hair. Mm -hmm. Now, when it comes to straight hair, remember the kind of comb that I was showing you guys to use. Huh? There's just a comb that you're able to clearly get it anywhere, anywhere. in what's whatever store that mm -hmm. you walk in. Then, of course, when it comes to curly hair, there's a detangler brush. Yes. Remember, detangler brush, and it is plastic, not metal, 
plastic and it's very very the, soft yes the bristles are quite soft they're very very soft mm -hmm. that's what you do then when it comes to washing it's also very very different how you wash a straight hair mm -hmm. and how you wash the curly hair you see when you're washing the straight hair at the end of the day you just easily just wash and run your fingers, fingers through, through it yeah. and that's it then again when you're done with it you just lay it out and you let it air dry. air dry when it comes to curly hair it's very very tricky because at the end of the day once you're done you're supposed to Remember to squish the hair going upwards. Please use this as an squish example. I know it's not, it's, okay, not fine. Curly, it's not curly, but, but I can use this, yes. right? For practicability. Yes. Now you see, if I've washed the hair and I'm done with it, what happens is that I need to swish the curls going upwards. upwards. Again, going upwards. Okay. And when I'm done with it, when it's about to be drying, do not dri dry it like this. Mm -hmm. What happens is that the water is so heavy, it's, it's going to weigh the curls, weigh the curls down. down. So what you need to do is that you just make sure the hair mm -hmm. is lying flat. Okay. And curly, let me tell you, one of the tricks that I normally do, mm -hmm. if it's a flat surface like this and mm -hmm. it's curly hair, mm -hmm. I normally push the curls inwards. Uh -huh. You get. So that when it dries completely, I've made sure that the curls are tight in and place. intact. Yes. So it just it's all about handy them, you know, with care. Yes. Indeed for sure, no matter what. Beautiful. And besides, we're just mm -hmm. a call away. Like we do the services for you. We yes. advise you at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. So you can always reach out. That's the beauty about this kind of business. You usually fix the client's hair and give the after service after sale services or the services, you know. Exactly. Yes, amazing. Because if guys, the other thing when I very first I met you. One yes. of the things you told me about wigs is this is an investment for every lady. It is. Please, what did you mean by that? Mm -hmm. An investment, I mean this, ladies. You can imagine, for instance, uh, this hair is 43,000 shillings, right? Mm -hmm. Now, this is able to last you five to even 10 years, depending on how you take care of it. And I know we, after these episodes, mm -hmm. you will be able now to take care of them yes. properly. You can imagine how you're always going to the salon. You're always unbraiding, they're charging you. Mm -hmm. You're always conditioning, they're charging you. You're always flat ironing, they're charging yeah. you. You go out again, you need to change it after two weeks. You come back. Just calculate how much money you've actually used at the end of the five years. Yes, true, true. How many? Yeah. Exactly. And you see, you're putting strains on your hair. Mm -hmm. I have beautiful hair, but once in a while, I let it breathe. I let it just stay. Because yes. at the end of the day, that is my hair, mm -hmm. not this. Yeah. So what happens is that buy this, mm -hmm. take care of this, and it's truly an investment. Yes, true. I agree because off, off camera, we were trying to do the math. Yes. And it, indeed, it is true. <laughs> It getting is. your wigs you know or you know these bundles and get them fixed or have a customized kind of wig for you yeah. it's an investment just yes. take care of it and you can switch it up play around with it yes. that's the beauty about it yes, and you will forever be grateful for your own self yes all right yes Bartha, it has been amazing having you on set we've learned a lot you. oh before we go you did mention about the heat oh yes, yes that's another to the thing heat. that when really you're... yeah that really destroys <laughs> yeah i'm so sorry i'm so sorry guys yes okay fine mm -hmm. now there are two things about the heat mm -hmm. when you're styling your hair okay. always always make sure that you're going to apply a heat protector a heat protector they come in different different forms i love the argan oil mm -hmm. Not that I promote them or anything of the sort, but get a very, very good hair protector yes. because you can imagine at the end of the day, it's a hundred percent human hair. Mm -hmm. I have a hundred percent human hair, and when I go to the salon and then deal with my hair, they still use the heat it's protector. Heat protector. Exactly. Yes. So use that, and when you're laying down your front all at the end of the day, use, use the, the blow dryer back on cold, cold setting. Not on hot, cold, cold setting. Settings. Yes. All right, and you'll forever have beautiful, amazing hair. Of course. Thank you so much, Bartha. Thank I've you. really learned a lot. Thank Just you. that I don't, I can't wear wigs and I don't wear wigs, but <laughs> I now be able to pass that message or information to my sisters. Yes. And uh, thank you so much for that. Thank you. And if one wants to find you or work with you or mm -hmm. get pampered by you, where can they find you? They can always find me either on online. Mm -hmm. uh, we are in Facebook and also Instagram. Mm -hmm. It's at Miss B Loft. Mm -hmm. And for the physical shop, we are in Westlands. Mm -hmm. Bandari Plaza Mezzanine 2 and Bandari Plaza is on Woodville Grove. They're always there. All right. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you so much as well. All right. Guys, there you have it. If you're a lady, you adorn wigs, never go wrong again. Never be caught by, you know, the other fashion police that we talk about. <laughs> Thank you so much. Until next time, slay us out.